Today I'm going to show you how to use the minus front feature in Adobe Illustrator. I'm using a Mac computer, so that's what I'll reference on my keyboard shortcuts. I believe in Inkscape, this is called the difference function through the path menu. Uh, but basically what you're going to do is we're going to grab a shape, grab a circle here. We're going to come back over here and we're going to duplicate it. Change the top layer to a different color so we can see it. So now you can see we got two. And basically what we're going to do is we're going to take this top layer, the red one, overlay it onto the green one into a certain amount and we'll cut out basically this portion here of the bottom layer. What's important is that you have the layer that you want to keep on the bottom. So on Adobe Illustrator, that's the hierarchy here. Bottom is bottom, top is top. So we'll get it laid over. Click them both, so they're both highlighted. Come over to Pathfinder. I have a shortcut window already opened up. You can find Pathfinder by going up to your top menu, going to Window, drop down to Pathfinder, click the check mark, and it will open up for you. Once that's opened up, again, Pathfinder, and you're gonna go to minus front. And then you're left with whatever shape you have put on the top layer there. I'm going to hit Command Z to undo. I'll show you how you can do this for other shapes as well. So let's say I want to make this circle uh, half a circle with a straight edge. So the easiest way I found to do this is to turn on your ruler if it's not already on, which is Command R. Turn it on, turn it off, turn it on. And you'll come over here to the edge, depending on which side you want to do. Pull it down and drag a guide over. And you're going to put that guide right there in your center line. Then you'll grab a rectangle. Again, change the top color so you can see it. And all you're going to do is just drag it over. Just make sure this side's covered so that it touches perfectly with that guide. And you have a straight edge. Highlight them both. Pathfinder, minus front. Now you have a clean half dome or a half circle that you can use for your designs. If you have any questions, please feel free to put them in the comment section below and uh, we'll respond. Thank you very much.